And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Golden Outriders. This is going to be our next meme tier uh, Monday deck today. So we just went with double Jarvan, trying to get two Jarvans in play. This is going to be another double deck. We're going to have double Allegiance. So we're going to have both of the Allegiance cards for these two regions. We're going to have Golden Ambassador and Avros and Outriders. And so that's our name, Golden Outriders. I've never played a deck that is going for both Allegiance cards before. Uh, we were basically split in the middle, about 50-50 uh, for each one. A little bit more failure than Sharima, because Zillion can put Time Bombs back into play, or like back into your deck to make it more Sharima cards. Um, but really what we're doing here is combining these Allegiance cards with Predict. So we'll have all these different Predict cards um, in our deck that can hopefully set up the, the top card of our deck to be able to hit the uh, specific allegiance that we need. You know, so we'll use like the, um, you know, like get a Freljord card, on, put it on top and then play Outriders or put a Shurima card on top, then play Ambassador. So that's really cool. So that's really what our deck's about. We're also gonna have the Xenotype Researchers with all the Predict. We may find some some things that are buffed up by three threes. Um, but for the most part, some a pretty low curve. We'll have Lissandra Zillion for our champions. We'll you know kind of do some Frozen Thrall stuff. Um, in here with Lissandra, and uh, that's going to be our deck. Are we going to win a lot? Who knows? But this is going to be our first time trying two different predict cards in the same deck. All right, so let's go ahead and play our five games in normal. All right, we got a Lissandra Talia deck. So they're going to be a Turbo Thrall deck. The Turbo Thrall deck um, is going to be one that will be killing us super fast with a bunch of 8-8s, eight uh, so we don't really need Avalanche. We can take out Troll Chant. Fl Flash Freeze is good against 8-8s. Eight I kind of want to keep that. Um, it just helps keep us alive for a little bit longer. Our deck has tons of 1s and 2s, especially 2s. We actually have tons of 2s in our deck. I know it doesn't really look like it. I forgot to change the board and everything to make it, you know, we're just in Demacia of Dragons. This is not... <laughs> this is not a... If we lose this game, it's going to be because of our board. Um, but yeah, we have really drawn all of our top end. <laughs> Crazily enough. What do you make of that? I'm not sure. Ages past, yet I remain. We'll change the board and stuff after this uh, game. Okay, well, I guess it's just time to time to guess. What do y'all think? Is it going to be a Shurima card or a Frelio card? All right, so there's 21 Frelio cards in the deck, and we've drawn one, two, three, four, five Frelio cards. We've only drawn three Shurima cards, so it's probably more likely to be a Shurima card on top. All of this is ours. Tilt. Boo! Boot's here. How you doing, Boo? All right, we'll just go ahead and pass. So I guess now we're just going to go Outriders. United, yeah, all right, that hit. We had it the whole time. All right, they're just kind of attacking here to clear up room, but I will oblige, I, I suppose, because um, I don't really want to take the damage. But they're trying to clear up room for more Frozen Thralls and stuff like that. Okay. 5 6 overwhelm Lissandra. Not bad, not bad. All things grow cold. It is time for you to prove yourself, my warrior. I dare not yeah, have any other, my lady. This deck's honestly really good with like all these uh, cards and stuff. Like getting all these 8-8s and stuff like this. This deck's honestly really good. Like this Turbo Lissandra. Like Turbo Thralls. I've talked about it before. Like whenever we play the Turbo Thrall deck, we usually win most of our games. And whenever we play against it, we usually lose. It's really hard to stop these 8-8s. What's up, Goomba? It is quite difficult to stop these things. Not 
I don't know if we can, let's see, what do we have for like removal? Nothing? Okay. No, we're not a turbo thrall deck. We have we have Draklorn, I guess, but that's that's really about it. We call by the War Mother Peace. Mm. We're trying to do two different allegiance. Or like that's that's like the goal of our deck is to to be able to do the Freljord and the Sharima allegiance. This is but a battle. I've already won the war. I'm not sure why more people don't play that deck, to be honest. The like I said, I don't love the Talia part, but all right, here we go. So now we got Ruthless Raiders, so we got got some early stuff. Scrying Sands. Oh, so we don't need Avalanche. Scrying Sands. Because obviously Avalanche with Ruthless Raider don't doesn't really work very well. What do I think about Scrying Sands? I think I think that, let's go with it. I think they'll have like three threes. Frozen Thrall. That Frozen Thrall is a great draw. This could be the reason why we win the, this game is this Frozen Thrall. And now we can have another Frozen Thrall. Yeah, I think we just have to go with another Frozen Thrall. So why w would you Scorched Earth an 8 count Frozen Thrall instead of a 7 count Frozen Thrall? All things were cold. That's question 1. Question 2 is, un unfortunately they do have Scorched Earth. Alright, so they're just using a bunch of removal. But maybe these thralls can sit back. <laughs> Destruction feeds my fire. You will do as I command. Well, we just gotta get these thralls out right away. Burn. Fight or die. Born a patrician, I became a soldier. Winter's three right now. So like these things are tough. I don't think they take any damage. So I think it this it just dealt four total there, right? So yeah, so seven. So it dealt one damage to both of their things and one damage to both of our nexuses. Pain is nothing. Let's I guess another Lissandra. Bristle, attack. Witness strength. A fight. So I can do this the scrying sands and save this, but then I just got another Lissandra. If I would play, Leave nothing standing. if we would play the um, the scrying sands, also we would reset uh, the predict. Just a, does one and one. Right now twelve. I didn't really plan on doing this now, but yeah, I kind of figured. So that's going to do three and level it up. Mm. Such little this 
is looking very bad. Have the city breaker to start with. We can always rely on you to keep us safe. This is very bad. Such little lies. Leave them nothing. Don't touch it. Yeah, it just doesn't. Doesn't matter. I guess I should have done this first. Could have saved two life. Right? Yeah. I don't. I don't know why I didn't play that. I. I need to play that. Oh. Well, I guess that's why. Cause now I take avalanche. Okay. Last game. Good game. All right, now this time, Lissandra's Wayne. All right, looking for our earlier curve. There we go. We want, you know, Frozen Thralls. We want Zillion. Frozen Thrall, good. This is a, a nice one, two, three, though. Frozen Thrall, Ruthless Raiders, you know, type researchers. We'll take that. Our deck doesn't have very much power at the top end. Like, our Frozen Thralls are kind of like the power, right? So, like, we want to get these in play right away. But then we got to have, like, our early stuff. And that's the first game I kept a 4-mana Allegiance card in my opener. And that was a lesson Let's learned from that. Board. Should not have kept that. Um. That's new. Wait, Vulnerable on the sentry just isn't really important, right? Like, we want a vulnerable something else that matters. So let's just play this researchers. Plus, getting the plus three, plus threes out as soon as possible is also very good. My opponent had two free damage. They could have dealt to me, and they didn't. I'm not exactly sure why. But I'm not mad at it. The winter's claw strikes. So a drop with Swain could be Leviathan. exactly what we were looking for but probably none of these could be i mean we could take out riders but we probably want like our champions or something that'd be my guess so we want our champions Will no one listen? i follow the Freljord's true leader all right that worked we gave our our opponent the opportunity to you know spend their mana by leading with the predict card, and so they spent their mana, didn't keep removal up, and Draclorn came through. No, two Farons, not too many Farons. You can you can definitely play two Farons. Oh, we were saying two Farons with three Leviathans. That that's pretty heavy. Now you're getting to pretty heavy areas of top end cards. Awesome. Hit that allegiance. Mm. So, like, if I Ice Shard, it kills the Beard, but then it kills, you know, two of my things. Done. We kind of have to just play this right now. Yeah, we kind of just have to play this right now. <laughs> nine nine overwhelm and then it also hit so the next card's probably yard as well yeah we kind of have to play that before attacking Away. 
So you have to imagine it's like Scorched Earths and stuff like that. Um, even if I wanted to like Merciless Hunter, I can't really stop them from dealing in damage to the uh, those Outriders. So that puts him down to four. So we don't want to cast Scrying Sands uh, because, you know, like we just gave, after playing this 9 9, we just gave like our top unit plus three plus three and Overwhelm, right? So we don't want to predict and shuffle that thing away. So we only have one card in our hand that we can even play <laughs> right now. We can't play Avalanche, can't play Ice Shard, can't play Scrying Sands. Golden Ambassador. Alright, that'll do. All right, we got our Frozen Thrall stuff going. We hit some Allegiance, got a 9-9 Overwhelm. That was pretty sweet. All right, so we can't keep... All right, so we're playing against Kindred Karma. This card's definitely gone. Then, you know, like, we don't usually want to keep our top end too much. Yeah, we have one right of negation. Ooh. Okay, that's unexpected. A last wins. I don't know, maybe outriders, I guess. So I do, I do want to just get this Frozen Thrall going as fast as possible, which is why, like the other, the other game that I played the, um, the Lissandras right away, because I want to get this countdown going. Been denied. Guess we could try it again. It's not likely to get denied again. Okay, so they have six cards, I have five. And we want to hold the time in the bottle because we don't want to let them know that we're going to be, uh, that we're going to be using it. They would have attacked because you know I would have been able to use the scrying sands and blocked. A 
Okay, Draclorn's interesting. Where there is light, there is hope. Come, my warrior. Show me your worth. I live and die for you alone, red lady. Alright, first eight eight. But they got both champions. Wow, killing both their champions. Sometimes you gotta do it. Alright, so we're gonna play this to predict. Um, these are all Shurima cards. <laughs> uh, well, I'll take the Golden Ambassador, I guess. And I guess we won't be playing the Outriders. <laughs> that was my plan. I guess I should have just played the... I probably should have just played the Xenotype Researchers first anyway. Oh, and then we missed. Morny with the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you so much. Alright, so if we know we missed there, that means we know we're going to hit here. <laughs> um, I probably should have done it the other way around, though, is test the Outriders, because hitting with the Gold Ambassador is more important. So, so I, did that, I just did that pretty quickly. Oh, dang. I did that pretty quickly. Well, that's what I should have done, is I should have done the Outriders first. Yeah, Shadow Flare, not a card I was expecting. But Morny, thank you so much for that Twitch Prime sub. I really appreciate that. You are sub number two of the day. Thank you very much. Okay, so our top card was Ice Shard. That's good against Draggling. They have lots of cards. They have lots and lots of cards. I'll be surprised if we win this. I really need to hit that with that Gold Ambassador. That was important. I should have done a better job of with that. I, I played that too hastily and didn't really think about it. But yeah, we're going to just die to card advantage now. Yeah, Ruination plus Shadow Flare, two, two good sweepers. For sure. Yeah, so I won't time in a bottle right away. We'll see if they spend some mana. On something, doesn't look like it. Because you'd think they'd want to try to play two spells for this Eye of the Dragon. Alright, better now. I mean, I guess this is the time. None of these are champions, none of them draw, but Xenotype's better. 6-6 six, six Xenotype's better than our average card. So close. So close. I'm saving the scrying sands for this draggling. Death by card advantage. Not all mean well. Level up Lissandra. Can do a lot of work. Excuse us. Kind of think I made it made us flash freeze this thing to save three in life. Hmm.
So Lysandra is, is round start create the ice shards. I don't believe it is. I don't think it's play. No. Yeah, it's round start. No reason to attack. Alright, so they don't get the Dragling, but I'd have the Ice Shard anyway. And that's why I blocked was because of Nopify Deny. Troll Chant could be good. In seven turns, we'll be able to play this Watcher. That'll do. Wow. They couldn't handle the two six power attackers. Wow, what a win. Good job, Lissandra. All right. Two and two. All right. Playing against another like very removal heavy deck usually like this is usually like a like a powder keg withering whale kind of deck. Zillion finally, <laughs> finally finding some Zillion. Um, so I like it. So let's we'll just send the Outriders back. But I don't know. I was kind of thinking about keeping that Outriders. Yeah, I like Dracolorn more. Because like we have like the predict stuff to set up our. Um, our allegiance, which is pretty cool. But we don't really have card advantage in this deck. You know, like, there's no... Um, what's the name of the card? Like, no Preservarium to draw cards, right? And so, like, we saw, like, against that last opponent that we just ran out of cards. But thankfully, we still got the job done. And it's all good. Haven't I been here before? Probably. All right, we're going to have turn three Lissandra to just get, you know, get another Frozen Thrall in play. These frozen thralls are very important. If I had your power, I would not squander it so. You want to get multiple of them in play right away. What you do, given the chance. I am inevitable. Alright, so what do they do? Parlay on the Zillion. One fours are good against one damage things. planning on next round being you know double Draclorn. like that's that's my plan i hope it works out we're gonna do like what we did before so we'll go with time in the bottle first and i think i'll just send all these back Outriders is the one that I would want to keep more than any other. But I kind of want our champions. Um, I 
It is time for you to prove yourself, my warrior. I dare not serve any other, my lady. <clears throat> okay. Frost gathers. You die, sir. Alright, they only got one card left. And here we go, double eight eight. Good job, Draclorn. Level up Lissandra. Let's get that Nexus all tough. It's going to be more difficult for them to turn on Plunder with having a tough Nexus. And I shall embrace the cold. Let's embrace the gold with the Flash Freeze. Yeah, so it doesn't do like it doesn't do any damage to the Nexus because the Nexus is tough. Yeah, that's going to just shut them down in their tracks. Okay, GG's. Their deck's built around doing, like, one damage to things, and then we have, like, you know, Zillion was a 1-4, so it took a while to kill Zillion, and then, yeah, Lissandra's tough. Like, that, that Lissandra is pretty rough for our opponent. So there we go. There's our Golden Outriders deck. Um, we got to do... Uh, we didn't get to do too much of like the allegiance things, but it was pretty sweet playing both allegiance cards. We never hit on Golden Ambassador ever, but we hit on on Avros and Outriders quite a bit. <laughs> you know, um, that's too bad we didn't didn't get to draw any champions with the Ambassador. But yeah, that was pretty cool. Um, I liked. I mean, really, I think that these thralls like one of our losses was to the Turbo Thrall deck, and I really feel like these thralls are are really powerful these days. Like Frozen Thrall plus. Um, all the advanced cards and so I was just you know impressed with doing that and I wonder how Avros and Outriders would perform in a deck like that I'm not sure but um, yeah that was that was kind of like the best part of our deck for sure Lissandra just looked incredible um, in multiple games Lissandra won us like those last two it was like all about Lissandra winning us the games especially leveled up Lissandra um, you know being tough be our Nexus being tough and then creating the um, ice shards every single round good card that's a good card and um yeah that's a it's a it's a good strategy i really i really think that i think the frozen thralls are pretty sweet um anyway those y'all watching later on youtube hit that like button over there and of course as always feel free to leave those comments as well i'd appreciate that but thank you so much for watching some golden outriders and i'll see you for the next video